Hey guys, in today's video, I want to show you a proven concept presentation that my family has been using for three decades. Here's a harsh truth. Many presentations that you're taught today revolves only around your products and they're probably long product presentations which make your clients lose focus along the way, isn't it? I was taught the same type of product presentation back then and it had me struggling with my sales too. That's why I flew all over the world trying to learn the secrets behind creating a good presentation from top financial advisors in our industry. And this is when I came up with the term called the concept presentation. In my today's video, I'm going to show you one of the concept presentation that my father has been using for decades and I call this my father's presentation. Now before we move on, I just want to give you a quick introduction of myself. My name is Dr. Sanjay Tolani and I'm also the family leader of Sanjay Mentoring Family which helps financial advisors like yourself to become successful financial planners. Having been in the industry for 16 years, I have a unique view of what works and what doesn't in the financial planning world. And it is my hope that I can pass this experience to the new generation future financial advisors so that they don't have to go through the same struggle as I have. Now let me start off by telling you why you should do concept presentations rather than product presentations. It is very important to have a good concept presentation because it can be helpful to you build a good impression, build trust, build confidence, trigger the right pains, give a clear understanding and save time for all parties. In this video, we are going to learn about the concept presentation called my father's presentation. Everyone in the world falls under four categories. The four categories are luxury, comfortable, poor and charity. Now let's assume there is a family which is comfortable. This family ball is held at the comfortable position when a person is at work. If this person at work is removed, this family ball will usually fall down straight away down to charity from family members. To hold this family ball at this point, we need to immediately put a pump of money. Because if there is no person at work, we need to have money at work. This process is called income protection due to death or illness. The only two reasons why a person would not be at work is due to illness or death. Now let me show you an example on how to apply this concept presentation. This is my father's presentation. This is another three minutes. What is the product? Income protection. Mr. Client, everyone falls in four categories. Luxury, comfortable, hand to mouth and charity. Let's assume there is a family which is comfortable. Now this family is comfortable because this is what we call man at work. Someone is working to make sure that this family stays comfortable. But if this man at work is removed, this family will immediately start to fall down and it could go down straight to charity from family members. So to hold this family over here, I need to immediately put a pump of money. Because if there's no man at work, there should be money at work. And the simplest way to do that is have five times your annual income as income protection. Do you have any questions? No? All right, great. Sign here. And the third strategy that I use the most, which is what I want to share with you, the third strategy is what we call the assumed close. 
strategy. Yeah? The assume close strategy is where you have already assumed the client has agreed to buy. And you start doing paperwork. You don't even ask their opinion. I give you an example. You go to the doctor and the doctor says, um, yeah, I think you have, um, you have an asthma problem. All right, uh, I'm writing your prescription. Do this, do this, do this. Take this to the nurse, she'll give you the medicine. What is that? You have, the doctor has assumed you will take the medicine, correct? Why can't you do the same thing? Why can't you do exactly the same thing? Okay, we have identified, example, it works best with this one. Um, your family is comfortable because man at work, if, the fa if you are not man at, is not at work, we need to put a pump which is money at work and the simplest formula to that is five times of annual income. So your income, how much is your income? Let's assume it's $10,000 if they don't give you an answer within 30 seconds. Not 30, two seconds. If within two seconds they don't give you an answer, you assume closed. How? You do a hypothetical number. You use a hypothetical number like $10,000. Simple number. Easy to multiply. Five times 120, that'll be about uh, 720,000. Done. Okay. Uh, now, I need your passport copy. It's assumed closed. You start asking for documents that you would require. So in Singapore, you need the IC, right? Can I have a copy of your IC? And I need you to be able to transfer the money. Would you prefer trust, uh, transferring the money, writing a check, or paying by credit card? Which one would you prefer? You go straight to assumed close. What is the next thing that will happen? What will you get? Objections. What's the objection you will get? Sanjay, at least let me think about it. True? Fantastic. I'm going to give you 14 days or 21 days to think about it, free look period. True or not? You have 14 to 21 days to think about it. I'm still going to process the paperwork because you need it, period. Do you have any other questions? I hope you have enjoyed watching this video that me and my team have spent countless of hours preparing for you. If you would like to learn more about concept presentations like this, I want you to sign up to the mentoring family at learn.sanjatolani.com. Let me show you how you can become a successful financial advisor and together let's make the whole industry better. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe and let me know in the comment section what other videos you'd like to see from me. This is Dr. Sanjatolani, and together let's make financial planning easier for everyone to understand.